In this video, I will show you how to display PDF from URL in your Flutter app. I will be using this Flutter Cache PDF View package, which you can find in pub.dev. Add the latest package dependency version into your Flutter project. While in our main code, I have created just a simple column widget. Firstly, I will be creating a widget view for the PDF. It's a stateless widget class because it doesn't require state changes. This widget class returns a scaffold widget with an app bar title. And the PDF view as the body. So, in order to display the PDF, we have to use PDF constructor that comes from the package dot cache from URL function. Since we are displaying PDF using URL, and we have to provide a URL to the function. So I will add a string variable to the PDF viewer widget class constructor so that whenever we call this widget class constructor, we have to pass in the URL. Now this cache from URL function actually implemented caching mechanism to the display, which we can add a placeholder and error widget function. Placeholder is the widget that will be returned when the PDF file is loading. And in this parameter, it actually returns the progress percentage of the loading PDF file. So I will just display the progress percentage using a text widget. While for the error widget, it is the widget that will be returned when the PDF URL file failed to load, which I will just display the error text. Now we have completed the view for PDF. Coming back to our main column widget, I will be creating an elevator button And when the elevator button is pressed, the app will be navigated to the PDF view. When we use the PDF viewer cache from URL constructor, we have to pass in an URL. So I have prepared a PDF from the internet that contains 30 pages, which is considered relatively big in file size. Now I will copy the URL link and paste it into the constructor URL parameter. Now let's test it out in the emulator. So as you can see, when I click on the elevator button, it started to load the PDF file from the URL provided. And because the PDF is big in file size, while it's loading, it display the progress percentage.
Once the progress finished, it will display the PDF. The major benefits of caching mechanism is that the first time we load this PDF takes kinda long time, but if we navigate back and forth again, the PDF file will be loaded immediately because the file is cached. In conclusion, this is how you display PDF in your Flutter app. If you have any question, feel free to comment below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next tutorial.